What do you see here off Kent Avenue and North 12th Street in Williamsburg? This week, crews have been tearing down the old fuel tanks, which were here for decades, and later came to represent the arts community, says Zach Waldman. New York is a city of repurposing. It's a city of, of future and adaption and, and taking the ruins and turning them into great things. This stretch is part of the much larger Bushwick Inlet Park, which the city promised to develop along the waterfront in Williamsburg to Green Point when the area was rezoned. We thought it was very fitting that there could be a, a better vision for these structures instead of just getting torn down. While final plans have not been made at this specific part of the park, these tanks will not be a part. Friends of Bushwick Inlet Park explain the more open space, the better. I knew that it meant that the park was going forward. Like once they get the tanks down, they can start to test the ground. Every weekend, every single park is booming. You know, there's really little, you know, little space left. Neighbors, groups in the city will be back to talk about what happens at that section. Meanwhile, across the street here, by the end of this year, work will begin to transform this section. It's taken more than a decade and a half to get to this point, and some areas have been developed. There's no funding yet for the design or building where the tanks once were. More presentations and community meetings will happen in the next years, adding to the story of the place. In Williamsburg, Greg Mocker, PIX11 News.